What's going on, YouTubers? Heart Collector and Eat the Monsters not here, but our good buddy Quarrel is. Quarrel. Yeah. Quarrel, where you at? Right here. Where? Right here. Up here. Where? Quarrel. What are you doing up there, Quarrel? Oh, taking I, a nap. Taking a nap. What's yeah. up there? I've never. I didn't even know there was something up there, Quarrel. Yeah. How did you get up there? Elevator. Where? You have a secret elevator? No, I can't. I can't tell you. What? Why not? I have to tell you when you pause it. Wait. You don't want anyone on the camera no, to see? You can't tell your viewers. You can't it's a viewers. secret? Yeah. Oh, no way. Carl, you know what today is? It's Friday Free Day! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> you have to come down here, Carl, and help me celebrate. Okay. All right. Only if you pause the video. Wait, you don't want no one to see? Fine, no. I'll put the camera down, Carl. All right, show all right there. I put the camera down. Show me where it's at now. Okay. Oh, crawl. That's yeah. that's where it is. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. You gotta keep that a secret, crawl. You can't let anybody know. All right, crawl. Guess what? Today's a very special Friday free day. You know why? Why? All right. Because remember, we didn't get to invite you to the 100,000 subscriber special. Mm -hmm. We're making today a special video just for you, my buddy, buddy. Mm -hmm. We're going to do question and answer. So many people wanted to know questions about you, Coral. Okay. And I figured everyone should know about my best buddy. Okay. Does that sound like a good idea? Mm -hmm. Guess what? Mm -hmm. We hit 100,000 subscribers already. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Coral. <laughs> so crazy. You want to get ready to go ask uh, all those questions? Yeah, oh, wait. I have something. You have something? Yeah. Wait, Carl, is this new? Oh, yeah. You got new stuff. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty crazy. What do you have? What? The tire and a <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what do you have? You said you have something? Yeah, it's a secret. I can't tell you or the viewers. Oh, what is that? I can't tell you. What, wait, are you going to tell me what it is? No. How are you going to tell me you have a secret? And then, okay, your shop's closed. Okay, come with me. I have all the questions lined up at our review station. Place. Oh, it's that secret? Yeah. Is this shady? No. Not you yet. sure? Yeah, it is. It is shady? It's kind of shady. I don't even want to know about it then, Coral. What is that? Okay, fine. I'll go first. This is a change. You never let me go first, Coral. <laughs> you always try to bum rush me to the review station. All right. All right. Come over here. Hey, look, Coral. Da, 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 da. Yeah. We have leftover popcorn from the celebration. Oh, man, Coral. Guess what? This is all for you, buddy. Thank you! <laughs> I gave you some popcorn. And at the end of the video, I have a special surprise for you for being my buddy. Right now, you can have that. So what's this shady secret you have? Three, two, one. Oh, Carl! No way! This is crazy! You just gave me a play button, Carl? Yeah. But Wait, this is a YouTube play button. A shady. A shady one. What are you talking about? Wait, this says YouTube hardcore collector. Carl, congratulations <laughs> for surpassing 99,999 subscribers. Carl, you gypped me one subscriber. <laughs> yeah, I told you a shady. Carl, I'm missing one. <laughs> me and Ethan hit 100,000. You gypped us. Coral, this is super shady, Coral. Where did you get this, Coral? Uh, I made it. You made it? Yeah. Oh, Coral, this is crazy. Oh, my gosh. Actually, right. my what? buddy buddy made it. Your buddy buddy? Yeah. You have another buddy buddy? Yeah. What? He, he made this? Yeah, he made that. Your buddy buddy made it? Yeah. He can make custom play buttons? Yeah. Oh, this is crazy. You got to give me his information and then I can put it down in the description. Okay. That way everyone can make their own custom play buttons. Yeah. Oh, so that's where you got this one made? Yeah. Oh, next time don't make it so shady. Make it say 100,000, Crawl, You ripped me off. That's crazy. We have a Coral play button. Coral, congratulations. I'm going to hang this up, Coral, like right over here somewhere. After we take that banner down, I get to hang it up. We have our first ever play button from Coral. Yay, Coral! Thank you so much, Coral. Welcome. Oh, this is super, super awesome. I can't believe it. Thank you so much, Coral. Look, it looks legit from YouTube and everything. It has our little channel name. This is crazy. So anyone can make one of these? Mm -hmm. Oh, you just have to talk about your buddy, buddy? Mm -hmm. Oh, talk to your buddy, buddy. All right, 
ready for these questions, Coral? Mm -hmm. Oh, all right, there. I put it over there for now. It's all, it's over there. All right, so I have about, let's see, how many questions are here? 30 questions, Coral. Remember we did a questions uh, video? We asked all the viewers to ask questions. Mm -hmm. All right, it's time. Everyone has to get to know you, Coral. Mm -hmm. 30 questions. You ready? Mm -hmm. All right, some of these are going to probably be hard for you to answer, and some are going to be easy. You ready? Have a seat. Have a seat. Eat some popcorn. Have a seat. This is going to be a while. <laughs> you ready? Okay, here we go. Question number one. This one is from I'm Yellow Man 123. Who is Coral? Please reply. I'm new. Who are you, Coral? You're uh, your buddy, buddy. Yeah, you're my buddy, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and also, you're a shady businessman, huh? Mm -hmm. Little shady businessman who owns a store inside my house. <laughs> you're lucky I let you sell from here. <laughs> Oh, how do you know Hardcore Lector? This one's from Gam Gambaroja. Gambaroja. Mm. Do you remember where we met? Oh, talk about that story that we met at Walmart. Oh, when we met at Walmart? Mm -hmm. Oh, I got to tell him the story how we met. Oh, <laughs> so me and Ethan were shopping at Walmart one day, and right standing outside was this little tiny old man wearing a hat and some sunglasses, and he had a little mustache, and he had a sign. He was holding a sign. That was you. Guess what the sign said, guys? You're not going to believe it. It said, we'll do something shady for some popcorn. And I kind of felt bad for the guy because everyone kept walking by and pointing and laughing at him. And so when me and Ethan left the store, I was like, you know what? Let's buy some popcorn for this guy. So I bought just a cheap little $2 box of popcorn and I handed it to Carl on the way out. I didn't even know his name at the time or anything. I just said, here you go, little man. I felt bad for him. I gave him the popcorn. And then next thing you know, I get in my car, I'm driving away, and as I pass the front of Walmart, all I see is the sign laying on the ground. And I didn't see Carl anywhere. I didn't know anything. So then we got home, we, we uh, went to the trunk to go pop open the trunk to unload all of our groceries, and guess who was standing there inside of our trunk? <laughs> it was you! He, he's like, I told you I'd do something shady. He straight hitched a ride in our trunk and then got home. And then he had the nerve to ask me, can I pop some of this popcorn? I don't have a microwave. I was like, oh my gosh. So I let him come into the house and I popped him a bag of popcorn and we started talking and that's how we became friends. Yeah. Remember I showed you all the stuff I was collecting? All the Legos and Pokemon. And I think that's when you started liking Pokemon, huh? Yeah. When you saw all the stuff we were collecting? Mm -hmm. I think that's what happened. All right. <laughs> that answers that, how we met. Number Four, why does Coral wear sunglasses and a hat all the Wait, time? I think you skipped that one. Oh, yeah, yeah, right here. Oh, this is an important one. Thank you. From Tony Vloggy. Is Coral Ethan Monster? Why does everyone call me Ethan? I don't like them. I'm not him. Oh, I know, I know, I know. I know you don't like Ethan. I'll explain it later. Calm down, Coral. All right, guys, stop calling him Ethan. He gets all mad. Jeez, calm down, calm down. It was just a question. I didn't say it. Tony Vloggy did. Okay, this one's from GDFE. GDFL. Why does Coral wear sunglasses and a hat all the time? A lot of people wanted to know that. A lot of people wanted to know that. Why do you have a hat and glasses all the time? Mm. Oh, I know. Why I have sunglasses? I kind of know the story, but not the full story. I know what you told me. Where'd you go? Coral, what, what is that? Newspaper. Coral, oh, that's from when you got the world record? Yeah. You didn't tell me they made a newspaper article about it. Oh, this is crazy. Coral, you didn't tell me you had a newspaper article about it. You told me that you hit the record and everything. Look at man now holds the new world record. Oh, that reminds me. Look at this question. The next question. Someone says, does Coral hold a record for being the shadiest man ever? Well, I heard the I hold the record for fooling the most co ultra man. <laughs> You're about to choke on your popcorn. <laughs> Wait, go go show me. I know you have it. You showed me before. I saw the world record. Coral, why don't you hang this stuff in your shop? This is like memorabilia. You should be showing this off. Guys, I'm gonna have to read you this entire story. This is crazy. I haven't even read this whole story. I didn't know the whole thing. Whoa, there it is. Coral, you hold the Guinness World Record for the most ultra rare Pokemon cards pulled in one day. It was 5,000. 
335 cars. <gasps> Coral, that's your real name. I forgot about that. Someone asked what's your real name. I remember that. Coral Relay Pishtof? Is that how you say it? No. That's not how you say it. Oh, oh I'm just trying to read. Coral Relay Pishtof. That's not how you say it. Okay, sorry, sorry. In LA, California on December 10th, 2016. That's how you say it. That was right before you opened up your shop. Coral has it. Coral, you need to hang this in your shop from now on. This is like too good look i'll hang up my youtube play button that you got me right i'll hang up that awesome play button and then you hang up this right. does that sound good because you need to show that off and oh no oh your popcorn no, <laughs> okay let's move this out of the way move it out of the way all right you ready coral oh, okay <laughs> it's still good all right move this over ready we have to read this story oh what's the next question wait is there anything after that Number, where are we? Oh, why does Coral like popcorn and goldfish? Mm. Why do you like popcorn and goldfish? Because it's cheap and it tastes good. <laughs> you shady bub. You just like it because it's cheap? Right here, guys. Man now holds new world record. There it is. Coral Relay Pishtof Pools. Is that how you say it? No. All right, sorry. 5,335 ultra rare Pokemon cards in one day. And pays the ultimate price. That's not how you say it. So this is going to explain why? Everything? Coral, that's you. Look. Yeah. This is the picture of Coral really pissed off? No, that's not how you oh, say it. Oh, I'll get it right sooner or later. Right, right here. It says, Coral really pissed off? No. Uh, that's how you say it? No! Oh, I don't know. I'll get it sooner or later. Takes a quick picture of Hall right before paramedics arrived. I definitely did it, Coral said. <gasps> we have to read this entire story. Oh, we have to. We definitely have to, right, Coral? Guys, let's read this entire story. Look at that picture. Look at all of those ultra rares. That's all the ultra rares you pulled? Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. In Los Angeles, as a crowd gathered outside a local home in L.A., many people were confused on exactly what this man was trying to accomplish. Carl, really pissed off? No! A, I don't know, Carl. A grumpy collecting bum is what his neighbors would call him. Is that what your neighbors used to call you? Yeah. A bum? Mm -hmm. A collecting bum? Uh, <laughs> they wanted to accomplish, he wanted to accomplish something no other man has done. His record attempt is to open 10,000 booster packs in one day. Something no one ever dared to attempt. You really wanted to open up that many packs? Mm -hmm. The Guinness Book of Records judge Marvin B. was present at the event. He told us that Carl contacted him a few days prior to the record-breaking day. He sounded very angry and upset on the phone for some odd reason. Why are you always mad all the time, Carl? Mm -hmm. That is a good question. Hopefully someone asked it. Marvin said, I later found out that's the way he is all the time. When Carl told me what he was trying to do, I immediately thought it was a joke. At that point, Carl threatened me and told me I have no other choice but to come or else. So I came. Did you seriously threaten a Guinness record judge? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why, Carl? Why are you that shady? Carl's neighbors knew he was up to something. He would always leave his house with an empty blue Walmart bag. And come back with the bag extremely full. Hey, what would you put in there? Uh, packs. Booster packs? Mm -hmm. You were on. You were buying ten thousand booster packs. Mm -hmm. His neighbors said, "I've seen a lot of shady people in my life. No one comes close to him." Coral began. So you are the shadiest person. Yeah. Coral began opening packs on December 9, two thousand sixteen, at eleven p.m. on what started as a booster pack record attempt. Coral soon realized that he had something better at hand. I've never seen anything like it, said Tom, a neighbor of Coral's. Do you still keep in touch with Tom? <clears throat> you don't talk to him no more? No. He was pulling an ultra rare card on every other pack he would open. That's what Tom said. Witnesses say he reached his goal of 10,000 packs in 15 hours. Coral, you opened up 10,000 packs in only 15 hours? Mm -hmm. That's insane, Coral. I can't believe it. Coral wouldn't stop. At that point, he had pulled 3,568 ultra-rare cards. 
Witnesses said that Coral announced that his goal has changed from opening 10,000 booster packs to pulling 5,000 ultra rare cards. Well, you changed your Guinness record attempt. That's insane, Coral. The crowd started to get bigger. At this point, I implored Coral to call it quits, Tom said. All of us were telling Coral to stop. Me and the neighbors and even Marvin. There was no point for him to continue. I tried to convince him one last time to stop and that he doesn't have to do this anymore. He then turned to me and shouted, I definitely have to. <laughs> Coral, you always say that, huh? Yeah. You definitely have to? Why do you always say that? I, love <laughs> I knew then that this man had a point to make. Still don't know what that point is or was, but I wasn't going to get in his way anymore. Witnesses recall him pulling 5,000 ultra rare cards by the 20 hour mark, but Coral didn't stop. He wouldn't stop. That man's shadiness overtook him, said another neighbor. That last hour he kept mumbling to himself. What were you mumbling, Coral? Look it. You kept mumbling this? Yeah. Say it. The last hour he kept a mumbling. What were you mumbling to yourself? I definitely have to. I definitely have to. <laughs> the last, you were going crazy, Coral? Yeah. The last hour would be Coral's undoing. According to witnesses, he started to squint a lot and would complain that the lights were too bright. It got to a point where he had to turn the lights so low we couldn't even see what Coral was pulling. Tom said I knew this was bad, but there was no reasoning with him. He would have been fine today if it wasn't for that last pack. That last pack was an X and Y flash fire booster pack. With one minute remaining, he pulled one of the rarest cards you can pull. An ultra rare hollow gold mega Charizard EX. <gasps> that was the secret rare. Yeah. You pulled the secret rare on the final pack mm -hmm. before the timer was up? Mm -hmm. Witnesses say that the second he saw it, he fell to the floor. We all thought he must have fainted from exhaustion, Marvin said. We then heard him scream. Oh, what were you screaming, Coral? My eyes. You remember that day? Mm -hmm. You messed up your eyes? Mm -hmm. We all rushed to him and he told us the light hurts. Charizard burned my eyes and he kept covering his eyes. The neighbors called 911 and Coral was rushed to the hospital. The doctors then diagnosed him with permanent photophobia. Coral, is that why you don't like Charizard? Mm -hmm. He messed up your eyesight when you pulled that final card? This is crazy. I didn't know that, Coral. You always said because he burns your popcorn. Look, photophobia is an intolerance of light that is caused by certain eye conditions. With treatment, it can be cured. But according to Dr. Nick, MD of USC Medical Center... That is not the case with Carl. To constantly see so many bright reflections every few seconds for a 24-hour period, I'm surprised this man is not blind. Due to his permanent disorder, he now has to wear medically prescribed sunglasses all the time unless he's in total darkness. Carl was released the next day. Carl, you didn't tell. Those are medical glasses. That's why you can't take them off? The doctor gave those to you? You'll go permanently blind if you take them off? Mm hmm that's crazy. Coral, you got to protect your eyes. You pulled way too many EXs in one day, Coral. Yeah. <laughs> you definitely had to. Yeah. You shady man. Look what you did to yourself. Oh, man. In an interview with Coral, we asked him what was next for him and what he planned to do with the thousands of Pokemon cards and booster packs and booster boxes he hasn't opened. I want to open a shop and sell overly priced collectibles to people. <laughs> That's what you said. He said while eating a large bag of popcorn. You were always eating popcorn. <laughs> I definitely have to. I definitely have to. His other plan is to promote his shop on YouTube using a close friend hardcore collector who just started his own YouTube channel. I remember that. Remember when you came to me and asked if you can open a shop in my house <laughs> and if we can film it on YouTube? <laughs> oh, I said, yeah, of course, because you were my buddy. Look, he's my good buddy buddy, and I will give him buddy buddy discounts so he can show my new shipments to everyone. When asked why he would try to sell items that are so overly priced and the many complaints from his neighbors of his constant shadiness, he punched our camera and took out a shotgun and told us to get out. Girl, this is crazy. This was all printed in the newspaper. This was in the actual newspaper, the actual LA Times. So you have the Guinness record, huh? Yeah. Oh, but look what you did to your eyes. You permanently damaged yourself for that. Mm -hmm. Was it worth it? Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> Would you take anything back? No. Oh, because you hold that record? That is an awesome, pretty sweet record to have, though, Coral. Congratulations, you have the Geddes record. Most EXs pulled in the world? Yeah. <laughs> now everyone knows that's crazy. We got to get back to all these questions. What's even next? All right. Uh, where are we at? Where are we at? Uh, right here. Right here. I what, yeah, you yeah, said yeah. that. How long has Coral been in business, and how did he obtain his amazing collection? Andrew Larison. So you started your shop. It was right after you hit that record, mm -hmm. like in December? And then, how did you obtain that amazing collection? Mm. Remember, you started what was left over from what you didn't open from the yeah. from the Guinness record, and then mm. what else? Uh, how else did you do it? Um, by returning all the cards, EXs. You sold all those EXs you pulled, mm -hmm. and that's how you raised the money to open your shop. Yeah. Oh, that was a pretty good idea, Coral. Yeah. You killed two birds with one stone. Killed two stones with one bird. <laughs> <laughs> you were able to open a shop and hit the whole the world record. What is your favorite Pokemon card from Pokechamp 1? Oh. What's your favorite Pokemon card? Popcornio. Popcornio? Any kind of Popplio card? Yeah. Just because just why do you like Pop Popplio so much? Because he goes pop, 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 Oh, why do you not share your popcorn from Hypex? How come you don't share it? Cause oh, um, because I don't, I don't like sharing it because I, I buy, I bought it and I want to give it to people because I spend oh, it. All right, we get the it. idea. We get the idea. You don't like sharing, all right? All right, we got it. Why is Coral so shady from Lucario Star? Oh. I think we answered this yeah. one before, huh? Yeah, the Fairfield one. Yeah, you used to work at the Fairfield company, yeah. huh? Yeah, and then I was making those cubes, and I was putting popcorn in there. And you were weighing packs up. Remember yeah. you, I remember you told me that. Carl weighed so many packs working at the Fairfield company that he ended up getting used to it, and he just became shady and started doing all other kinds of shady things. Yeah. Man, you worked there for a long time, didn't you? Yeah. What was the first thing that you had in your shop from Lawson Polar Vlogs? Um... My vintage packs. Oh, your safe? Mm -hmm. You never even told me you had the safe until way later. <laughs> the safe was the first thing you even had in your shop? Yeah. Is there any more reasons why Carl doesn't like Charizard? From Oliver, Animals, Lizards, Toads, Turtle. Wow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's a crazy name. Well, yeah. One, you said he burned your popcorn, and now we all know the truth. He burned my eyes. He burned your eyes. That Charizard card burned your eyes. You saw too much shiny reflections, Carl. Oh, what is under Coral's shady hat? Oh, should we save that one for last? Yeah. All right, remind me, okay? Because mm -hmm. we're going to have to dim the lights down and everything, right? You can take off your hat sometimes, right? Yeah. Just your glasses you have to keep on? Mm -hmm. All right. Why is Coral interested in Pokemon? Uh, from Tristan Pitts. Oh, that one was from Jack Bergman. From mm -hmm. Tristan Pitts. Why is Coral interested in Pokemon? Um, Because I could, I could buy them in... And sell them and, and um um and rip people off. <laughs> Just because you want to rip people off? Yeah. Because you can sell the EXs. That's why you like it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This one is from John Terranova. Terranova. How did you start your shop? Uh, I think we already answered yeah. that one now, huh? Because <laughs> you sold all those cards. That one answers that. You sold all those cards from pulling from your Guinness record. Oh, read this one. Oh. Why does Freddy come alive? And then that's a separate question. All right. This is from Really Stupid Video 52. Why does Freddy come alive uh, in your shop? He just, he just comes to my shop. Why does he come alive, though? Why does he come alive in your shop? To take care of my shop at night. Oh, he's just like a little bodyguard? Yeah. Oh, what? To try to steal your popcorn? Yeah. All right. And then someone said, or right, same one, does he have a website? Do you have a website for your shop, Coral? No. No, all right, that was easy. You can only buy the stuff at my shop. Oh, you have to come personally. Yeah. Does no. Coral name his mustache oh. Sparking Pikachu? Do you have a name for your yes. mustache? Mm -hmm. What is it? Carl's Jr. <laughs> Carl's Jr.? Yeah. That's the name of your mustache? Yeah. You named it Carl's Jr. <laughs> I never heard that one before. <laughs> all right. What, what is your last name? All right, so this is from Crazy Family. We just announced it. it's 
Pishtof, right? No! That's not how you say it! Oh, I'll get it right one of these days. Okay, something like that. Do you live in your shop? That's yes. a that's a crazy question from Jackie Vargas. What do you mean, yes? I took You're, it off in my shop. You live in your shop? Yeah. Quarrel, since how long you been living there? I don't know. Quarrel, you live here in the shop? Yeah. Is that what you were doing up there at the top? Yeah, so basically you have another house inside of another house. Quarrel, you never told me that you were living here. Did, I need to start charging you rent, Quarrel, you shady <laughs> bum. You've been sneaking in here and sleeping all the time? I knew you were going in my fridge. I caught you that one time. Quarrel, you didn't tell me you sleep here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I saw that. I saw that. He was winding up the phone. Quarrel, stop hitting my camera just because I found out you sleep here. Quarrel, I'm going to charge you rent. I'm charging you rent. All right, here we go. Um, Quarrel, do you eat popcorn every day? From Diego Epic Gamer 107 Martinez. Yes, the easiest question. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes, he does. What, breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Yeah. Every day, always, all day? I always eat it for breakfast, lunch, dinner. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. How old is Quarrel? Sa Samir Diaz. Uh, I don't know. You you don't know or you don't remember? I don't remember. You're that old that you don't remember? Yeah. What? Quarrel is so old he doesn't even remember how old he is? Quarrel, why are you so mean from Jaden Gonzalez? Because uh, people try to steal my popcorn. Oh, I remember too. You remember one time you told me because everyone that used to make fun of you when you used to stand outside Walmart asking for popcorn? Yeah. People used to call him a shady bum all the time and he got all mad. Now you take your anger out on the world, huh, Coral? Yeah. Man, am I your only friend in this world? Yeah. Oh, uh, you need more buddy buddies, Coral. You're a pretty cool guy, Coral. Mm -hmm. All right, <laughs> Coral, why don't you and Ethan ever want to meet up from Yo Yeah Blaff? Oh, this is a good one. Why don't you and Ethan ever want to meet up? A lot of people say to put you two guys together. And you guys have already been in some videos together. But tell them. I already, I already know. Because, because he, he tries to take my popcorn. Yo, this is what happened. I'm going to tell them the real story. When the day that Coral came to the house and we popped the popcorn for him when we first met him, Ethan thought it was okay to eat it because we popped it in our microwave. But Ethan went to go grab some and ate some, and Quarrel nearly punched him. You almost put, and I almost didn't forgive you for that because you're a stranger trying to punch my kid, Quarrel. But then he explained to me the whole story that that's all he eats, and he's a bum, and I felt bad for him. I felt sorry for the guy. But you never forgave Ethan for that, did you? One of these days you're gonna have to forgive him. You hold grudges, Quarrel. That's why you don't have. That's why you don't have no buddies. You're never gonna forgive Ethan. Yeah. Quarrel, Quarrel, come on. I still haven't gotten any of Quarrel's popcorn. I ran off with a couple times, but the shady bum is quick. He catches up to me and takes it back. Okay, why do you have a mustache? Smarties Pikachu 190. Um, because um, it holds my popcorn. It helps catch popcorn? Yeah. It holds it? <laughs> when you're eating, mm -hmm. does it soak up all the butter? Yeah. And then you lick your mustache after? Mm -hmm. <laughs> that, that makes sense, I guess. Does Coral have his own Pokemon collection from Chibi Toy Bonnie 2006? Do you Obviously, yes. You do? Yeah. Are we ever going to get to see it one day? Yeah. Okay, I got it. Of course. All right, that's pretty cool. We're going to do a, a collection video for you one day then. Why did Coral wear Ethan's pajamas? Dione uh, Garcia. I remember there was a whole long other uh, sentence to this. Uh, but in one of the videos, this guy said you were wearing Ethan's pajamas. I remember that too. Why were you wearing Ethan's pajamas? Uh, because... Uh, since I live here, I wouldn't eat this bedroom and took his pajamas. What, Coral? <laughs> you you go in my fridge, you sleep in my house, you steal Ethan's clothes. Coral, you are the shadiest man ever, you know that? And you're proud of it. So, <laughs> someone give this little shady man a world record for being the shadiest man ever. Please, he deserves it. How did you get that shady Walmart bag from Ismael Perez? How did you get your shady Walmart bag? Because... I went to um, I went to Walmart and then I got a shitty Walmart bag because I liked it. Because you liked it? Yeah. I remember you told me you needed to hold all that popcorn yeah, you had. Yeah, I did. You, you gave me so much popcorn that I needed a bag, so I just got the shitty Walmart bag. <laughs> that was the closest bag you could find because you were yeah. standing outside Walmart? Yeah. Or right, we got two more questions left. Mm. Ready? Ask Carl about the Freddy who comes alive in night. Ash Ishan. All right, so a lot of people want to know about that Freddy, Coral. Where did that Freddy come from? I don't know. Who put it there? No one. He just appeared in my shop. You didn't buy it? No. 
No one shipped it to you? It just appeared. Oh, it's like that Annabelle doll. Did you ever see that Annabelle scary movie? Cool, there's like a doll that you can't get rid of it. You throw it in the trash and it'll come back and haunt you. Is that what Freddy's doing? Yeah. Oh, that's scary. Cool, no, that's a cursed dog, Cool. We, oh, I don't. We're gonna. I, mean, I talk with him. Sometimes. All right, and this one comes from. Oh, look at from a very smart guy. This question comes from a very smart dude. <laughs> <laughs> this was. This is a really smart guy. Let's see what he asks. Final question: What do you love the most in this world? That's the easiest question ever. It's popcorn. Popcorn, yeah. Quarrel loves popcorn. That's all the questions, Quarrel. I think everyone's gotten to know you and know why you're my yeah. buddy, buddy. Yeah, Quarrel's got the best moves. Yeah. Show them all your moves, Quarrel. Yeah. yeah. Proud of Quarrel. All right, yeah. guess what, Quarrel? Thank, <laughs> thank you for coming. Thank you, especially for that play button. Yeah. Guys, I'm going to get the information from Quarrel's friend, his buddy, buddy, and put a link down below. You guys can all custom make your own YouTube play button. You can make it say your channel name. You can make it say whatever you want, however many subscribers you want. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't even have to say crawl congratulations, huh? It can say whatever you want. Yeah. Oh, you could even get one and put hardcore or hard collector's biggest fan. Oh, congratulations. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> oh, crawl. Just for you coming here and helping out today, guess what? You can have all the popcorn. Here, I'm getting rid of Charizard. Ah! Get rid of Charizard. Yeah! There you go, Carl. All this popcorn is for you, buddy. Oh. There you go. We're buddy buddies again, huh? Best buddies? Oh, guys, he went into a coma. Quarrel! Quarrel! Wake up! Guys, subscribe down below. Hit the call 911. Subscribe down below. Comment. Like this video. Quarrel! Oh, he passed out from all the popcorn. Quarrel, wake up, please. Quarrel!